Welcome back. Adding a touch of gourmet to its portfolio in India, Lay's has launched a premium range of slow-cooked premium kettle chips, Lay's Gourmet, and along with that, a new TBC for its offering. This launch is in fact in line with their strategy to provide a spectrum of innovative and delicious snack options to the consumers. I caught up with Shailaja Joshi, Director of Marketing, Potato Chips category, PepsiCo India, and spoke to her about how do they devise an innovation in potato chips category category every few months, especially in a market such as ours with varied local snacking options, their consumer engagement strategies around the festive season and main focus areas in the coming months. Shelja, welcome to CNBC TV team. Thank you, Shivani. Very happy to be here. Shelja, first of all, let's uh, share with us the idea behind the launch of uh, Lay's Gourmet. And I know I have tried it in the Mumbai market, but which other markets uh, will you be uh, launching this particular product? Yeah, so Shibani, first of all, thank you for trying Gourmet. And uh, I hope you really liked it. Uh, uh, we've launched Gourmet as our entry into the premium potato chips category, or I would say more like an experiential snacking, right? Uh, because we've seen that uh, the trends in India uh, currently, as well as going forward, are going to see a lot of households or consumers who will be looking for premium experiences across foods. And snacking is going to really see that beef up. Uh, we've launched Gourmet uh, in all markets. Uh, you will see it across markets. And it will be led by the largest stores, modern trade, e-commerce. We have tie up with all the relevant stores so that you can find it wherever you want. If you can share a, a, a few insights on, uh, you know, your spends and media mix and how will it change around this festive season eventually when things, uh, you know, are uh, opening up, you know, where families can visit one another, where uh, Durga Puja and Ganpati will be celebrated with a lot of gusto with crowds, uh, you know, coming to visit uh, the pandas and the mandals. On Lays, we've actually been very active this year. We start and we've launched big platforms, not only products. So we started the year with launch of Wafer Style mm -hmm. and we supported it adequately, in fact, quite rigorously uh, for it to become a substantially big innovation for us. Then we brought Lays Sizzling Hot to India. And that's another campaign uh, that we broke with uh, Ranveer. And that has been doing really well for us again as an innovation platform. Uh, with Lace Gourmet and with the onset of season, uh, we will be supporting again uh, both Gourmet on TV or on media, not to say TV, but on all 360 media channels, uh, platforms, as well as on ground to make it visible to consumers where they are and, you know, in a way that it really stands out. Mm -hmm. Coming to your point, uh, and hence, we will be putting in substantially good amount of money to support uh, Lay's Gourmet and all our innovations uh, during uh, the festive season. However, for Gourmet, because it's a very premium product, what will be substantially more important than our other campaigns is how we play up digital, how we play up social, how we play up e-commerce, and also how we play up on ground or how we, you know, the visibility part of how the gourmet stands out on shelf is going to be substantially important for us. Hmm. Correct, correct. And, I, uh, you know, Shelja, I've been itching to ask you this. Uh, you have been coming up with one innovation after the other is what we have seen in the past, uh, you know, few months, and you rightly said that. Uh, and India is a very complex market, uh, you know, when it's with its own uh, regional snacking options. Like everyone has, you know, some farsan or khakra or whatever in their respective regions and areas. So how do you devise, uh, you know, a new innovation every few months in a complex market such as ours? And, you know, what works and what doesn't work? How do you decide that? How do you take that call? For least. What we believe in is that while we keep the Indian consumer and this many Indias very close to us, we also have a very strong understanding that consumers want their much loved brand lace to bring to them a lot of international experiences to India, mm. right? And hence, when you see that, you know, our mix usually has a good, uh, you know, play of both these factors coming together. Mm -hmm. Sizzling Hot, for example, is a very, very successful global platform flaming hot for us. Right? Mm -hmm. It's very successful globally. But when we brought to India, we were very clear on what kind of product 
India will love because we love our spices like no other. Nobody else understands spice like we do, right? Our product is different from what we have globally. It is adapted to an Indian consumer's palate, but it is still, it takes a lot of inspiration from what has worked globally because we have a lot of expertise there. Hmm. Wafer style for that matter, you know, is, is uh, we, we know that uh, India is already a big market for a flat cut chip. Right. We see that not only in branded, but a lot of unbranded players. Mm. So the, the, the whole idea of bringing a flat chip is itself emanates or is rooted in the culture of India. Mm. And what we've ensured is that we've launched it with three flavors, each one of them bringing alive the cultural nuances. We've launched them basis cultural or regional preferences. And we will continue doing that with wafer style very strongly. Yeah, yeah, great. Uh, thanks for sharing that. Uh, Shailja, also, uh, you know, in spite of things uh, working either uh, in a hybrid uh, format or, you know, people coming back to work full time, uh, PepsiCo has reported a double digit growth in snacks volume for the second quarter in India. Uh, is this momentum expected to continue in the coming days? What is uh, What are your thoughts and uh, what do you have to say on that? I think both are core brands like the Lace Core led by programs like In Home, driven by large packs and our innovation platforms, whether they are, and all of them are incremental. When we go and launch anything like this, we are very clear in launching, you know, all these platforms with a mix and with a consumer proposition that is giving us a huge incrementality. It is not, you know, really eating up from our business of core. So that again is leading to us for incremental growth, which I think should pay off in future because we've got some solid plans for future on leads. Great. And having said that, can you share these plans going forward? What will be your main focus areas for potato chips categories of PepsiCo? For us, I think there are the very clear uh, three areas which we want to drive. One is how do we keep driving the growth momentum on our core? Right. So how do we keep driving this brand love of a, of a brand like Lays, which is very strong? It's a very strong brand. Right. The second is how do we drive in home consumption? Now, in home consumption could be with large bags. How do we get consumers to stock us at home, which we've already started doing with our uh, you know, Lays at home program? Uh, how do we start selling more of large bags? through outlets, et cetera. So it is going to be a complete push-pull strategy of driving in-home consumption for us. And the last one is how do we really drive premiumization as an agenda? That's going to be a big thing for us. We've already given it a boost with Max, which is already a big platform for us, doing well. Then we've got Gourmet that we've launched. Even Sizzling Hot for us is slightly more premium to pour with the kind of audiences, with the kind of experience it provides. It's it's also slightly premium, but yeah, these are three big pillars for us that we're going to keep driving. Great. Thank you so much. Thanks for joining us today. Thank you so much, Ivani. With that, it's a wrap on Storyboard this week. You can catch all of our content on Facebook, Twitter and YouTube. Thanks for watching. We will be back same time next week. See you soon.